Hello people, I'm the Anime News Reporter. I broadcast news so you can know about it. Today, we're going to see what happened in the Mexican Nazi base at Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. I'm going to interview Mr. Speedwagon, owner of the Speedwagon Foundation, as he is a witness of the bizarre events that occurred there at morning till noon. I know you're frightened, Mr. Speedwagon, but tell us, what happened when you were taken hostage by Nazis? And what events did you see in their base in Mexico? <sighs> well... What I saw was monstrous, and I will tell you, the events I witnessed in the most cool and calmly as I possibly can. Santana! Santana! Speedwagon, ah! speed I need you to calm down. I need you to calm down. Now take a deep breath. Deep breath. Deep breath. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay, now once again, tell me, what did you see in that base? There's this ultimate life form, which is a pillarman, who are associated in creating the stone masks. And this one's name is Santana. And he, and he, and he fucking ate a vampire! He fucking ate him! He fucking ate him! He fucking ate him! Oh god. No, god, this isn't working. Can I get somebody else? Stroheim, jawohl! Can you tell us what happened in your base with the pillarman, known as Santana? Well, it all began when we captured Mr. Speedwagon, and we decided to interrogate him with truth serum, and then all hell broke loose. Oh my god, what's happening? Get me out of here! Jojo, I'm scared! Where's Mr. Joestar, Mr. Zabale? Oh, why the hell has he showed up? Why did you give him more truth serum? Sir, we gave him the truth serum exactly two hours and thirty minutes ago. And he has not yet revealed his secrets to us. And as a result, he keeps on talking. But that serum only lasts twenty minutes. Why is he still talking? <laughs> and that's what happened. Uh, okay. So can you tell us your experience with Santana? Ah, yes. Well, he ate the vampire, which was born by wearing a stone mask. And he ate him by absorbing him into his own body and boon appetit. Then uh, more shit happened. Because we <laughs> lost sight of him. So we were in quite a frenzy. However, we managed to maintain our cool. Was he like? Where's he fucking went? I don't know, sir. Where's he fucking went? I don't know, sir. Do you know where he went? I don't know. Do you? No, sir, I don't. We're all gonna die. <laughs> oh, God. And then we found him inside of the vents. And how did he accomplish this? Oh, by breaking his bones and skin apart until he managed to fit inside the vent and then he entered one of my soldiers' body. So we decided to kill him by firing at him, but then he just fired the bullet back at us by injecting it all of his skin. And what course of action did you take after that? Oh, we did what any soldier of the Reich will do in that situation. We squealed like little bitches. <laughs> There you have it folks from the witnesses themselves. Tune in next time before we talk about episode 13 of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. I'm the anime news reporter. I broadcast news so you can know about it. Wait a minute, isn't this week's episode 13? And what about episode 6 through 11? Shit, I don't know. I'm just covering for the anime hero today. For I heard he's really busy. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, people, if you want more weekly Jojo, then leave your opinions in the comment section below.